One state highway in eastern North Carolina will soon see a speed limit change. Today, the town of Cedar Point voted to reduce the speed by 10 miles per hour on Highway 24. Nine of your sites, Camila Barco, spoke to town officials about what prompted the change. If you're planning on driving on Highway 24 through the town of Cedar Point, you're going to want to slow down. Starting next week, the speed limit will change from 45 miles per hour to 35 miles per hour. Welcome to the town of Cedar Point, a short trip from the Crystal Coast beaches and the town of Swansboro. But it overlooks Highway 24, known as a speedway for drivers. People are on vacation. It's a busy busy time of the year in summer. So busy, car accidents are a common sight for Kelly Hunt. So I've actually seen about two wrecks here. It was one afternoon I was leaving and it was a loud noise and I look out and it was the guy was completely flying by. In the past three years, a total of 188 car accidents have been reported in the area. So on August 27, Cedar Point Board of Commissioners unanimously voted to reduce the speed limit. In fact, if I remember correctly, on the 27th of August, there had been an accident that morning. The portion of the chain stretches from the intersection of Highway 58 to the White Oak River bridges. Well, certainly it should make it safer. I know a lot of the accidents occur when people are trying to, to cross 24. People like Hunt are in favor of the town's decision. I think it's going to be a very great cause. I think that um, people, it'll get everybody's attention and maybe go 35. Others are calling the change ridiculous and a terrible idea. But the town of Cedar Point is confident the new speed limit will lower the amount of car accidents. The change will begin this upcoming Monday on November 4th and drivers will be alerted through digital message boards along Highway 24. In Cedar Point, Camila Barco, 9 on your side.